What's happening guys, my name is Alex and welcome to a new Photoshop tutorial. Today I'm going to show you guys how to remove the background of an image because uh, this is like re like requested so many freaking times. So uh, today I'm going to show you guys how to remove the background. I would say let's jump straight into the video. Okay guys, so let's start off with removing the background of the picture. So basically as you guys can see, I just took a screenshot of a video. I don't know which one I've so, uh, I've uploaded. I'm going to watch 700 videos. Don't ask me from like which video this, you know, this picture is or this screenshot, but I'm going to use this picture um to show you guys how to remove the background really easy, like pretty detailed as well. So basically what I would recommend is using your quick selection tool. And first of all, guys, I want to say sorry because everything, as you guys can see, is in Dutch. The problem is I would like to have everything in English, but the retarded thing is I can't change the language without installing the entire program. So, but I'll, I'll just, you know, I always will say like, it says this, it says this. So if you, if I say like, you want to go to this one, you probably don't understand like a word. I'll just gonna say like, you're gonna go to file, blah, blah, blah. Actually, you'll, you'll kind of understand it. So the first thing you wanna do to select and like remove the background is you wanna use your quick selection tool. And then what you want to do is you wanna, you can hold alt and scroll up to zoom in and out. And basically I'm gonna uh, remove the background, which is everything, including my chair. I'm gonna like leave my chair in, as you guys can see at the back. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna go all around and I'm going to select everything, except for like myself and my hands and stuff. What I'm gonna do now is I'm just gonna select everything in the screen and I'm gonna look for any details I missed because I wanna like still have my chair on nice around like my cap. And then I'm just gonna start at the bottom here. I selected everything and I'm gonna press delete, boom. And now you can see like what I did and what I like selected what I missed. So you can always press Control Z of course and then it's back. I'm gonna look for things I missed like or even like that were like that are not necessary in the screen. So as you guys can see I missed like some little new spots here. Um, so I'm gonna also select this and actually remove that. And that's basically how you remove. I would say like deselect and I would say pick your um, your eraser tool and make it like solid. Not like a fade. What I would suggest is just go around with your like um, with your eraser tool and make it nice and even. So you can also zoom in like on certain parts. And as you guys can see, it looks way better now. It doesn't matter like it's not completely straight because your clothes like are not like completely straight at all, like always. This is gonna take a lot of time, and you guys know how it works. I mean, you can just go red all yourself. And I'm gonna just, you know, focus on doing this and make everything look perfect. And then I'll be back, coming back to you. A few moments later. Okay, guys, so I just got done um, removing the background. And as you guys can see, that is how similar to this. That's how you remove the background. You just wanna select everything uh, that you have in your screen, except for like yourself or like the thing you wanna like blur, blur out or like, you know, cut away. So you just wanna select everything thing but the only like but not the thing that you want to have like in the screen so you can remove the background of, and then you can just you know take your eraser tool and then you can make like really nice edges like as you can see like right here like you can zoom in like a lot and then you can just go like go around it and it makes it makes it looks really nice i mean it's always some sloppy stuff if you just remove the background like so and if you don't do this like it looks really great at all so that's some of this guys that's how you remove the background and, and, and of course you can play something underneath it but that's going to be for the last for the next episode so how to change your background that's coming up in two hours so make sure to stay tuned and that's basically it that was the video guys i want to thank you guys for watching thank you guys for the continued support i will see you guys tomorrow for two illustrated tutorials with ldhh official of course thank you guys for liking and commenting on this video make sure to smash the like and the subscribe button for more videos so you will stay updated so thank you guys and i'll catch you guys tomorrow it's me again. Um, I know I, I haven't uploaded a video uh, for a while on this channel. You know, all the kind of movies was a great actor uh, the past several months. Um, basically, uh, some of you may know uh, that I'm a partner media crowd. Let me explain this from the comment section down below. So I'm just gonna uh, put this completely random. Thank you guys, and I'll see you guys next week.